So I'm Curtis, own the uh, Battlefield Barbacoa here in uh, Queen Creek, Arizona. When I was in the military, it was kind of like the squad platoon barber there. Yeah, I guess I just try to like treat everybody the same, you know, just try to make everyone comfortable. You know, I try to keep the shop family friendly so the moms can bring the kids in, dads can bring the kids in, you know, just try to keep it family. It's a good atmosphere. I like, the, I like the atmosphere that we give off here in the shop and we've had a lot of good feedback as far as the atmosphere in here as well. I guess I try to keep like the traditional barbering, like traditional barbering starting to fade out. I like the, I like the traditional way of barbering the barbershops you know just barbershops were the, the the social club you know in the neighborhood that's where everybody went to get you know local information and news and stuff that's happening i like to keep that but also with like more of a modern twist with it you know but i'm i'm always been a big fan of you know older traditions and old ways old school stuff is i guess is what i've always been a fan of and that's how i, I guess i've tried pretty much making my shop around I like, like self-driven, you know, self-motivated type people that you don't necessarily have to uh, look over all the time, I guess, you know, to make sure they're doing the right thing, the right time, the right place. Just somebody you can trust is a big thing for me too, is trust. If I, if I can trust them, you know, then definitely have them on, on the team. I enjoy all the services that we do, whether it's, you know, doing an old traditional, you know, gentleman's cut to the high tights or beard trims to full face shaves. You know, I enjoy doing all aspects of barbering. Be nice to everybody, you know, treat everybody equal and fair and like family.
biggest thing with like whether it's barbering or anything in life, just if you have your goals, set them and reach them. You know, it doesn't matter how how far fetched they seem. Their goals are always you always to obtain them. You know, just you get up to you on how much work and effort you want to put into it. This took a lot for me to to get where I'm at now. And looking back, like it was it was tough, but I wouldn't I wouldn't change it for the world. You know, I enjoy where I'm at and anything in life. I teach my kids the same thing. You know, if you have your goals. Do what you have to do to, to accomplish them and achieve those goals and you know, the reward will be at the end for you.